Hello, Linked HR, and happy week. I'm Dr. Chris Wilderbooth, your community chair, and as I promised last week, I'm going to bring you this week our brand new book club. So here's what's going to happen. Uh, we're going to recommend to you a book. So the book we're going to start with is called The Practice of Adaptive Leadership. It's by Ronald Heifetz. Uh, let me see if I get it right. Alexander Graschel and Marty Linsky. It's the book that it's a book that I adopt quite widely at Drake University in our course in Leading Change, and um, we think we're, you're going to enjoy it very much. So in this session, I'm going to show you where to go in the linked HR page to get the book and to see where the discussions are going to take place. I'm going to have a very brief introduction to what the book is all about to get you excited about reading it. And then each week for the next, um, for the next few weeks, uh, Mel Wildermuth and I are going to be bringing discussions, present brief presentations, explanations on some of the pieces, but mostly we're going to be asking questions and hoping that you will participate in this discussion. So let's get started. All right, so once you are in the linked HR page, um, the book club is going to be under curriculum and book club and then you will see the practice of adaptive leadership right here. Don't worry about that because we are going to uh, give you the exact link. And of course, if you click here, it takes you straight to the Amazon page where the book can be found, okay? And here is the area, here in this area for the practice of adaptive leadership is where we're going to be running our discussions and um, asking our questions and uh, introducing some of the presentations and so on. And we're also going to be announcing those on linked HR each week. All right, so let's get started. First question that I have for you is, what do you think is the relationship between this picture and leadership? Think about it for a moment. Hint, this is a picture of a swamp. So, what do you think a swamp has to do with leadership? And that's a question that very often I ask uh, our graduate students at Drake University's uh, Master's in Leadership Development when we start talking about uh, change. One of the issues about leadership is that we often think that it looks like that. There is a person in the front who knows exactly where to go, who um, knows exactly the direction, and then everybody's going to be following that person. When in reality, in a situation of change, leadership looks kind of like that. Nobody knows where to go, and sometimes it's a swamp. It's messy. It's muddy. Um, it is, um, there is no clear view of what's going to happen next. And yet, we are still holding on to some myths. And one of the myths is the myth of the hero leader, the super person who is going to be um, hired to save us and to take us to paradise, to a land where nothing wrong ever happens, is going to solve all our problems. Another myth is that that person who is taking us to that fabulous uh, land uh, has this magic telescope with a perfect vision and knows exactly where to go and is never wrong, or perhaps that of a fortune teller who knows not only where to go, but what exactly is going to happen when he or she gets there. What you're going to learn in the practice of adaptive leadership is that a leader is someone who can mobilize followers in a situation of change. And that situation of change is muddy and messy. And that leader does not rely on the magic of a crystal ball or the magic of a fantastic telescope that tells him or her exactly where to go. So what does adaptive leadership mean as, uh, as per uh, Heifetz, uh, Linsky, and Graschel. Adaptive leadership is the ability to mobilize followers to thrive in a situation of change. And to thrive in a situation in which you have 
no crystal ball, no magic telescope, and you are not a superhero. You need to rely on the collective imagination and creativity and uh, ability to see things from the collective, from your followers. An adaptive leader cannot thrive alone. That's what you're going to learn in this fabulous book. I'm very much looking forward to our discussions. So for now, get the book, start reading. Uh, Starting next week, we're going to be discussing the first few chapters. And in the meantime, how about if you enter in the discussion, uh, what do you think adaptive leadership means to you? If by any chance you've already read the book, you can go ahead and enter some of your comments on that as well. All right, everyone, have a wonderful week and happy learning. Mm -hmm.